Well, the college football season is back, and so are the fans. In full force, Purdue kicked off their season hosting Oregon State last night, and fans were back in big numbers. Fox 59's Eric Graves has more. Football's back in West Lafayette, and with it, the fans. Many for the first time since 2019. I might shed a tear. <laughs> I might cry. Yeah. Emotions are all over the place for the Purdue faithful. Last year, the Boilermaker football team played in front of limited crowds at best. Now the fans have the go-ahead to pack the stands. <laughs> well, we're going to be loud. We're going to be proud. We're in the stadium. We're in the seats. We're screaming. We're having fun. People are there. I am just looking forward to just like being in the like atmosphere of football games again and getting to cheer with everyone. Fans won't have to wear masks in the stands or provide proof of a negative test result or vaccination. We're, we're glad that masks are off. It's going to be a little bit back to normal. Students we talked to say the idea of getting back to normal is great, especially after COVID-19 completely changed their college experience last year. It's going to like everybody's going to feel the sense of community at Purdue, like what I felt when I came did my first tailgate, so I think it'd be really fun for all the freshmen too to finally experience it and sophomores. Large crowds packing stadiums will certainly be a shock to see for some after the year we've had, but fans here say they're feeling comfortable. I'm vaccinated. We're outside. We're all vaccinated, so we should be good. Yeah, we're we're all good. We're we're vaccinated, and uh, you know we're we're good to go. Fans are also excited to get out and support businesses here in their college town. Spend a little money at the concession stands and at the local. You know, bars and restaurants, some shirts, uh, it's great for everyone. The excitement and the hopes for this season are high in West Lafayette. Purdue kicking some butt, going to the Rose Bowl this year. In West Lafayette, Eric Graves.